Don't jump if you don't want to. Don't jump if you can't. Don't jump if you feel like you're going to get hurt. Hey guys, welcome back to Fit After 50 and today's workout. Today is another beginner workout that we are doing. Today, however, we are doing HIT. So it's gonna be a beginner HIT workout. Some of these exercises are a little more advanced, a little quicker paced. So I'll have previews for both the beginner version and a little more advanced version. Having said that, we're starting in 10 seconds. We started with our warm up, same format that we've been doing for a while. So we're starting with a three minute warm up with three different exercises. Three, two, one, and let's go. We're just doing like hugs, guys. Just taking those legs, stretching them out a little bit, and just hug that leg. We're doing this for one minute. There's going to be quite a bit of jumping in today's exercise. Once again, if you don't want to jump, you can jump or you want to alternate on the jumps. Do whatever you want. We'll have jumping version and the non-jumping version of each exercise. I'm going to perform me probably a mixture of everything, but you can do whatever feels more comfortable for you. What makes this a beginner workout is that the work intervals are 30 seconds which is going to equal to the rest intervals, which are also, also 30 seconds. So it's a relatively long rest interval between a relatively short work interval. Nice and easy today, guys. We have about 10 seconds left of these. Just hug that leg, bring that knee towards you, bring that foot up, get a nice stretch in the glutes. We got three, two, one, and now we can relax for a little bit. Before we move on to the second, exercise a second warm-up exercise nice forward lunge and just give me a twist and a twist nice and easy stretch everything out like I said it's gonna be quite a bit of crazy movement during this workout today so I just want you to be ready and flexible so for me it's six in the morning right now so just kind of woke up about an hour and a half ago I take my time in the morning so I'm trying to get moving with you so lunge forward and just give me a twist and a twist and lunge back. You don't have to jump, lunge that deep, whatever feels comfortable for you. All right. Once again, welcome to Fit After 50. My name is Paul, and you guys are just doing the workouts with me in real time. These are all filmed in one take, so not everything is always perfect, but it is what it is. Pretend it's a class that you're working in with me, except it's done in my little basement right here just twist I don't care what your arms go you can have your arms out here and twist here if you like you can have your arms on your hips and just twist or you can keep them where I like to keep them which is right here and a little bit of a twist and we have about five seconds left of this one and twist three two one and let's just take the rest of the time off all right now we're moving on to what everybody's calling the world's greatest stretch we're gonna get down on the floor perform this exercise for one minute I'm gonna do three on one side and three on the other side and then see how much time there is left all right 15 seconds so walk it out get in the plank position we got a couple more seconds left actually five four three two one again the plank bring that leg forward Stretch up, all the way right, reach to the ceiling and reach down. And all the way down and all the way back up. Hold it for a second and back down. Let's just do 30 seconds on one side, how is that? And back down, stretch, up, look up, hold it. Three, two, one, and let's switch sides. Bring that leg back, bring the other one forward and the same motion, up and down beautiful 25 seconds left up hold it and back down as far as you can go and back up and back down yes this is my favorite stretch up and down keep it up five seconds left this is the last one and back down all right and we are back to the top. So we are about to let me make sure my microphone is on. It is. All right. We're back to the top. We're doing a high knee run. Like I said, two versions of each exercise. You can do the high knees with running or you can just do this. Let's start off with the easier one. We're still kind of almost a warm up phase. So let's work our way into it. All right. So high knees, guys, starting in five seconds. Four, three, 
two, one, and if you're not running, bring those knees all the way up, all the way up. See how I'm kicking my hands? I want you doing the same thing. All the way, all the way, come on. 10 seconds left. Three, two, one, and relax. Next exercise is jump squats. Remember, 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off, eight exercises, guys. Jump squats, so you can jump on each squat. You can jump every other squat, or you don't have to jump at all. Pick your poison. And this one, I'm gonna see if I can jump a little bit. It's always weird jumping here because the ceiling's very low in, in, in here. Um, all right, let's get going. We got about five seconds left. Jump squat. Three, two, one, and let's go down and up. Fifteen seconds left. Keep it up. Explode up. Nice soft landing. Three, two, one, and relax. All right. 30 seconds up. That got the heart rate going pretty quickly. Next exercise, burpee. How you want to do it, it's up to you. You can do it with a push-up, without a push-up, with a jump, without a jump. You can just walk out and kind of walk back in. Whatever works for you guys, no pressure over here. Give yourselves a hand. We're moving out to the exercise number three, the burpee with a jump and a push-up. You guys ready to go? In three, two, one, and let's go. On the ground. And a jump. And on the ground. There are many ways to scale the burpee to the version that you can make for 30 seconds. Five seconds left, let's do one more. And a jump, perfect timing, all right. Whew. Now we're moving on to the skaters. Skaters are a little tough here, kind of limited on space. Basically, you want to be jumping left and right. You can jump and get all the way down to the ground, or you can just kind of do this. Whatever works for you. Get started in 10 seconds. Whew. We have seven and a half minutes left of working out. We got this, ready? Three, two, one, and let's go. And get down to the ground, all the way down. Side jumps, come on, work with me. Work with me, keep it up. All the way down, and a curtsy, it's kind of a curtsy lunge at the end. Get that heart rate moving. Should be moving pretty good already. Three seconds, two, one, last jump. And here we are back to the center. 30 second rest. Yes, I'm breathing heavy, because guess what? I am working just like expecting you to be working. 20 seconds left. All right, jump lunges, guys. These are tough. I might lose my balance, happens quite often. So, you guys know what to do. Preview is up, easy version, hard version. Let's go in five, four, three, two, one. Lunge forward and just switch and switch and switch. Keep it up, 10 seconds left. Five, four, three, two, and last one. Whew, that was a tough one. All right, 30 seconds of rest and the old jumping jack. Can have a hit workout without the jumping jack, especially a jumping hit workout. 15 seconds left. We're going jumping jacks. 30 seconds, as fast as we can. No holds barred. You guys ready to get going? In five. Four, three, 
Get ready, two, one, let's go. Quick pace, quick pace. It's only 30 seconds, you got this, come on. Move it, move it. Five, three, two, and one. Woo. All right, two more exercises left. More jump squats. This time we're going wide to narrow. Wide to narrow. Whew. Once again, don't jump if you don't want to. Don't jump if you can't. Don't jump if you feel like you're going to get hurt. Last thing I want you to do is get hurt. I want you guys coming back for more workouts. We get started in five, four, three, two, one. So just jump up, wide, narrow, wide, narrow. Keep it up. Touch the ground, bounce off. Very explosive workout today. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and last one. All right. One exercise left. Did we skip anything? Let me see. High jumps, jump squats. Perfect. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think we're good. All right. Broad jumps. I'm gonna step back to my wall. Jump forward. Take a couple steps back. Jump forward. Get a few jumps in. Very explosive. Try not to hit anything. You guys ready to go? In five, three, two, one. Jump. Land and go back. Make sure you don't hit anything. Or at least I should. And go back. And nice soft landing. Go back. And go back. Go back. And go back. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and that's it. All right, two exercises left, guys. You guys know how we end this. We end it with core. So, two exercises. We've been doing a lot of jumping. Let's do some static core exercises. Two one minute exercises. And they're both static. First is in this position. We're gonna do a hold. Legs up in the air, arms up in the air. One minute. Are you guys ready? Three, two, one. Arms up, legs up, and hold it. Best that you can. Best effort. My legs might drop. Minute is a long time. My legs are very straight. Partially because I'm not very flexible. Partially I'm not strong enough. And it's okay. Do the best that you can. Hold it. I might have to stop talking actually. Let me turn around towards you guys. Why am I facing the other way? Hey, here you go camera. How are you doing? Halfway done. Hold it with me. Hold it with me. Get those legs up in the air. Straight. Come on, fight it. 20 seconds left. Breathe it out. Don't fall. Keep those legs up. Keep the arms up. 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Chill. All right, guys. One more exercise left. Like I said, we're gonna finish off with static exercises. Well, the most famous static core exercises of them all, right? The plank. One minute plank, we got this, and then we're done. Our 15 minutes are up, boom. What a great way to start off your day. A lot of energy, good sweat, high heart rate, time to shower and get our butts to work. Five seconds, four, three, two, one, plank. Let's go, come on. Tighten everything up, Not, don't do this, don't do that. You can do this, lower down, lower down, tighten those glutes, tighten those quads, and just hold it. Nice and steady, 45 seconds left. Don't let your shoulders sag, hold everything up, everything tight. Right here, right here, 30 seconds left.
25 seconds left. Keep everything tight. Stay here with me for 20 more seconds. We got this now. 15. Almost single digits. And here we are, single digits, guys. We're almost done with the workout. Keep holding it tight. Don't let anything sag. Three, two, one. And now you can sag it down. All right, guys. Thank you for joining me today at Fit After 50. This was another workout for our beginner workout sessions. This one was a little bit tougher, but like I said, you can scale it down, do it to the best of your ability. So once again, thanks for joining me today for the After 50. My name is Paul. Workouts do come out every Monday and every Thursday. I hope you guys enjoyed this workout and I'll see you guys during next workout.